Live from NBC4, the station working for you. Southern California's number one news, the Channel 4 News at 4. The shootings last spring at Colorado's Columbine High School have apparently taught some important lessons to students here in the Southland. Our Gordon Tokamatsu joins us with a look at one school's safety solution, and it does not involve metal detectors or armed guards. All right, Gordon? That's right, Kim. The folks at St. Genevieve High School realize that many kids first start feeling isolated and angry when they're incoming freshmen. Social pressures at that age can make going to class every day a real challenge, so they're trying a new approach to the students' first year. Do you remember what it was like to be a freshman? Everything's new and intimidating, and the upperclassmen... Seniors are scary, aren't they? They are. They're intimidating. At St. Genevieve High School in Panorama City, they're taking that tension very seriously. Why? Because recent events have taught us a painful lesson. Because of Edinburgh, Pennsylvania, Littleton, Colorado, Jonesboro, Arkansas, Springfield, Oregon. Towns and schools that were stunned by how deep student anger and resentment had become. Anger that can sometimes spill over into violence. If we think that because we're a Catholic school, that we are immune to it, we're asking for it. So the school's trying something new. A surprise pancake breakfast this morning for the incoming freshmen. Their servers are their upperclassmen. The entertainment, courtesy of the seniors. The message is, let's not isolate and taunt the freshmen. Let's welcome them instead. To get the whole notion that the freshmen are inferior to the rest of the schools, to get that whole notion out of the way. The approach includes homemade posters, each one bearing the name of a freshman student. Attached at the bottom, handwritten welcome notes from the folks who used to be so feared. Steve Chavez read us his note from a 17-year-old named Emil. Hello, welcome to St. Jens, and I hope we make you guys like it. Will this last throughout the year? Yes, it will, definitely, and for the years to come, not only this year. Well, of course, it'll be a few years before we can determine if this approach works to stop the anger that leads to violence. But school officials tell us that making new students feel at home certainly cannot hurt. Kim Kelly? Great right. idea. Thanks, Gordon.